Hey guys, Jeroen here from thingstobuyonline.com and uh, today we're going to be covering joint pain relief codes. We're going to review the product, we're going to dive right into it here in just a second, but also uh, if you guys have been following me on my channel, you know that I have personal experience with back pain. Um, I've gone to the chiropractor and uh, I'll, I'll sh actually show you guys a, uh, an x-ray of my back and um, also I've gone uh, and bought one of those inversion tables a while ago so I've spent quite a bit of money on trying to fix my back pain and then I want to get into whether this joint pain relief codes uh, with Jonathan Bender has actually helped my pain so let's uh, you know without further ado let's go ahead and jump right into the product and cover that stuff first all right guys so we're in the members area right now and before we get into the uh, the book itself I want you guys to know that um, I was able to get you guys some bonus ebooks if you use the link below this YouTube video then uh, you'll be able to go ahead and get these uh, additional bonus ebooks or you could just go to jointpainreliefcodesreviews.com and uh, you know you can read my written review there and then uh, click on the links anywhere there and you'll be able to get these bonus ebooks easy yoga for full body healing and meditation for stress relief okay now let's go ahead and jump right into the main ebook joint relief codes and um, so well, let's start from the beginning here it's uh, 109 pages so it's uh, quite a bit of information and it's with Jonathan Bender who's actually an NBA player and um, first it gives a little bit of backstory about him and um, how he had knee pain and all this stuff because um, you know when he was in his growth spurt uh, during puberty he actually grew six inches in only four months so he had quite a bit of knee pain and then especially when he was you know playing in the NBA uh, he had to gain weight and stuff uh, you know get more muscular I guess um, but that put a lot more weight on his knees and all the doctors could do they couldn't fix his knees for him all they could do was drain the fluid out of them so it never really fixed them uh, but then he goes into all of these I guess secrets or codes that he learned in order to uh, fix those issues and uh, after he gives a little bit more about his backstory um, he's also talking about you know how uh, doctors and big pharmaceutical companies they don't want you to know this information because it's big money for them they sort of kind of want to keep people you know in pain and come it sounds bad but it, um, it makes a lot of sense you know they want them to come back and it's just big business for them if you have pain and you just keep going back to the doctor and keep you know taking those prescriptions but anyways uh, the reason I didn't actually this might sound kind of strange but I didn't actually buy this product because I had uh, joint pain because I had back pain uh, it's kind of funny but a, a, uh, a good friend of mine also had back pain and he'd been going to the doctor you know we always argue because I went to the chiropractor he went to the an actual uh, spinal uh, doctor whatever it's called but um, anyways you know he always makes fun of me for going to the chiropractor because he thinks it's just voodoo magic and it doesn't really work but uh, that's neither here nor there um, anyways so he uh, got all these prescription pain pills and you know he was getting kind of sick of it and he started to realize you know why I went to the chiropractor and I was kind of agreeing with him that you know maybe the chiropractor isn't really the ideal situation but I guess both either going to the chiropractor or to an actual doctor I mean they both have um, you know consequences especially you know with uh, prescription pain medication that stuff is really addictive and so you know he was starting to get kind of addicted to it and he was like you know what I gotta change something and he's like I found I found this you know joint pain relief codes but uh, I'm not sure if I want to go ahead and spend the money on it and I was like you know what it's cheap why don't you go ahead and get it and I was like hey you know what I have a YouTube channel where I review products online so let me just go ahead and check it out um, and see you know whether this is actually legitimate and then um, you know if it, if it works for me then perhaps it could work for you now I will say this though about uh, me going to the chiropractor is that I did get a lot of information about what was wrong with my back so instead of trying to fix it on my own uh, you know because a back is a very complex thing right your spine has a lot of joints in it so um, what I did was I had an x-ray done and here this is my back here this is uh, I took a picture with my iPhone uh, of my x-ray now you can see so what happened was I was taking out the trash and where I live here in uh, midtown Atlanta um, you I live in these you know they have all these really old houses and there are a lot of stone steps and things like that so when I have to take out the trash uh, you have to take it up some steps and down some steps and then it's really hard to lift with your knees and one day it was the trash can was just full of uh, old books and uh, and wood because my neighbor moved out and uh, anyway so I tweaked my back and you can see that my spine actually curves to my left hand side right there you see how it bends right there and so my what happened was because I was pulling the trash can and I was to the side 
and my hip shot up because one of my muscles tensed up more than the other side and so my uh, right hip shot up a little bit and it just made my spine kind of bow out to the left it sort of like rotated and bowed out to my left hand side and uh, that's where the pain came from so that is good that I you know had that x-ray done but even so you know you can get an x-ray for for cheaper than I mean I went to the chiropractor uh, several times and it was fifty dollars each visit which is relatively inexpensive but that's because my insurance covered it and I ended up spending like three hundred fifty dollars to go to the chiropractor and uh, so I mean uh, I, I stopped going because I mean that's kind of ridiculous you know and, and you don't even know if it really works but um, then what I decided to do was get one of those um, teeter hangups it's like an inversion table and I have a YouTube video about it uh, just go to my channel and check it out but it's right there um, but uh, anyways that cost me about 400 bucks and um, you know, because it's the I think they have cheaper ones that you get on Amazon. Some of them are like a hundred bucks. I don't know how good they are or anything like that. But uh, so I tried that, and um, you know, then after uh, you know doing research on that, uh, I did some research. You know, after I made this review video, I did some research on it, and I mean, it, it did feel like it helped me a little bit. But then I heard that it's only temporary because you're going upside down and uh, stretching out your spine. But then once you go back up, you know, your spine just slowly kind of compresses back to where it was. So it's just a temporary solution. So the chiropractor, going to the doctor, you know, teeter hangups or an inversion table, all that stuff is just kind of temporary. Um, it does make you feel a little bit better, but it's, you know, I wanted something that had a, a permanent fix because I like to do a lot of physical activities. You know, I wanted to get back in the gym and lift heavy weights. I wanted to go mountain biking. Um, you know, skiing, even running. I wanted to be, you know, I didn't want to have any pain or worry that I was going to mess my back up again. So as I was reading through, you know, the ebook, um, I started to realize more and more, you know, like I kind of agree with this stuff. Um, I'm, you know, uh, let's see here. So he's, t you know, he's saying, don't let doctors tell you, you know, you will always have pain. You will have to take pain pills for the rest of your life. Go back to physical therapy, all this stuff. And uh, this is him right here. Uh, the guy that, uh, sorry, I just drew a blank. I forgot his name. Let me check at the top real quick. Uh, Jonathan Bender. And um, so because, you know, he was playing for the NBA and then he had so much pain that he had to stop. And then um, he actually uh, worked with the best of the best doctors and um, pieced together the bits of information to come out with this um, you know joint pain relief codes program and uh, then after you know he had relieved himself of pain and kind of fixed his knees um, he was offered another contract to go play with the New York Knicks and uh, so then you know going into this book even more he talks about everything he's learned and how you can rid yourself of pain in natural way Look, sorry this video is getting a bit long so I kind of skipped ahead a little bit but uh, let me just get into um, just one piece that uh, kind of helps you understand how there are these certain exercises and stretches that you can do to relieve yourself of pain because um, joints, you know, they most likely are causing their, their pain, their, you're having pain in your joints because of muscles and tendons and, and cartilage. So uh, there are many factors that can lead to pain, but it doesn't matter what causes your pain. Um, there are ways to, to remedy this because uh, let's say it's a certain, like in my case, it was a muscle that tensed up faster than uh, the other side. You know, like if you go back to uh, looking at my back here, um, my, uh, I guess it was my buttocks muscle or the muscle, I don't know what it's called, but that goes from your butt to your back. Uh, the one on my right side tensed up faster and so that, you know, um, made my hip go up. My right hip went up and that made my back bow out and uh, there are ways, you know, there are very specific stretches that you can do to um, make your muscles stronger but also more flexible and to relax them so that you can get your joints to go back exactly to their natural, uh, you know, posture and shape so that will relieve your pain. And then once they're back into that natural posture, you will be able to then heal uh, in the right manner and then your pain you will be permanently relieved and you you won't have to worry about it now this was just uh, you know one example of my example it was muscles but it doesn't matter what caused your pain you know maybe you're thinking oh that's not gonna help me out 
Uh, but this, the, he has uh, these techniques or what he calls, you know, joint pain relief codes for any kind of uh, anything that has caused your pain. So whether you have had arthritis or, you know, tendonitis or any of this stuff here, you know, even lupus, rheumatoid arthritis, uh, you know, anything like that. So there are, you know, uh, exercises or uh, he even has specific foods that you can eat, uh, specific recipes that you can make to um, heal your joints, you know, depending on if like, let's say you have uh, cartilage that's lacking, you know, your cart cartilage has, uh, you know, worn out over time. Um, there are, you know, specific things that you can eat in order to uh, heal. And, um, you know, I'm not talking about taking like those glucosamine and chondroitin supplements. I mean, those might help, but any type of supplements, you know, even a multivitamin, uh, your body can't absorb all of that, and especially like when you get older or if you drink alcohol or if you have a, you know, some kind of liver issue, your body, you know, your liver can't absorb all of those things. Like when you look at the back of, for example, a multivitamin and it says it has like a thousand percent of the vitamin C you need, it doesn't mean that you're going to get a thousand percent of your vitamin C because your body just can't absorb all of that out of one pill, right? Because if that were true, then all we could do, we could just eat one vitamin pill and then we wouldn't have to eat for the rest of the day, right? Maybe add some protein or whatever, but uh, it, it, it doesn't work that way. So um, he's got specific recipes um, towards the end here. Let me see if I can find it. It's a really long ebook, but yeah. So he talks about the different foods and, and, and recipes and what's going to be good for your specific situation, whether you have hip pain, knee pain, back pain, you know, elbow pain, uh, whatever. And um, so I don't want to give away too much information because uh, I, I don't know if he would consider that stealing since I'm, I would just be, you know, handing it out. But um, this, you know, let's just get into the fact whether this helped me. And uh, all in all, yes, this has absolutely helped me. Um, I'm about to show you the full range of motion that I have now. Um, I can finally play sports again. I can lift heavy weights. I can even do squats and deadlifts, if you guys know what that means. And, uh, you know, looking at my back, you might be like, wow, how is that possible? But, yeah, I can do squats and deadlifts. Um, if, uh, if you know what deadlifts are, I was able to do uh, 275 pounds two times, and that's more than I've ever done in my life. I know to some of you uh, weightlifters out there, that's not that much, but to me, that's, that's a lot, and that's the most I've ever, ever done. So, you know, that just goes to show you that it, it definitely works. I mean, this, this definitely helps, uh, even with somebody that's got back pain, you know, from something like this, you know, back, it, it's very complex, and most people are like, oh, you know, they tell you, I don't know if you, if, you've, if you have back pain, and you may have heard people tell you, like, oh, you know, if you mess up your back, it's never going to be the same, but uh, I stopped believing, I, I, I believe that, and it's kind of depressing when you hear that, but now that my back is back to normal, you know, I don't believe that at all anymore because I've got full range of motion, no more pain. Um, I can do everything that I'm doing. I'm, I'm 30 years old, so, uh, you know, I'm still pretty young and I wanted to be able to do all the physical activities that I've wanted to do, right? You know, I want to be able to play sports, go hiking, running, you know, mountain biking, uh, skiing, um, you know, just doing all the crazy stuff that uh, you do as a 30 year old. And without having to worry about pain or messing up my back. So uh, uh, let me just go ahead and show you that I can actually move, you know, completely fine, unhindered, without. Okay, I don't know if you guys can hear me too well from uh, all the way back here. But uh, just to show you, you know, I can bend over without any pain. No problems there. You know, I can twist and do all that stuff. I mean, I, could do, I would be able to do squats, no problem. Right? So, yeah, I mean, I can do this, you know, jump up and down. And <laughs> I don't want to get too crazy, but you can see that I've got full range of motion and my back just doesn't hurt anymore. And uh, it's, you know, I'm, I'm really happy about it and it's great. So the uh, joint pain relief codes definitely works. Um, I would highly recommend it. It's very affordable, um, but make sure that if you are going to get it, use use the link below so that you can get those two bonus eBooks. and. Uh, that's that's really about it you know I would highly recommend it another great thing about it is that um, there's a 60-day refund policy you get a full refund if you're not happy with your purchase so uh, yeah highly recommend it I mean it's gonna change your life it definitely changed my life I can do everything I wanted to do again um, it's it's you know one of the best things that's happened to me for sure so I uh, highly recommend it so uh, my name is Jerome Waning, and uh, I'm from thingstobuyonline.com. Now, if you want to read my written review about this particular 
uh, review, just go to jointpainreliefcodesreviews.com and uh, you can get further information there, more information about the bonuses as well. Um, but uh, yeah, thank you so much for watching, watching my video and uh, I'll see you guys in the next review video. Hey, one last thing. Sorry, I forgot. Of course, uh, the bonuses, I forgot to mention those. I mean, I mentioned them, but I forgot to show you guys that. If you buy it through the link below, um, where you go to Joint Pain Review, Joint Pain Code, Joint Pain Relief Codes Reviews.com. Anyways, the link will be there. But um, then you get the uh, the bonuses. And here's here's one. So Easy Yoga for Full Body Healing. It's a 48 page ebook. Uh, you know, if you like yoga or if you never tried it, this helps you become more flexible. Um, anyways, just want to skim over it real quick. Um, you know, sorry this video got kind of long. Anyways, 48 page ebook and then um, here's meditation for stress relief um, ebook and audio series and this is a 35 page ebook and uh, it's got the audio series in there and uh, also another thing I forgot to mention is that in the uh, the main joint pain relief codes um, ebook uh, let me see if I can show you uh, where he says it that there are also some video series that you can follow along um, let me see if uh, he, where he says this Okay, so I found it. It's right here. So at the end of this book, you will find video sessions that I put together, especially for you to help you get started with your new pain-free life. Okay, and uh, yeah, so that that really is the end of this video. But thanks again, guys. Thanks for watching.